Another important query that you'll want to make as a provider is to figure out how many procedures you've done. Um, this is pretty similar to figuring out how many patients you've seen in the past. You'll go to chart reports here on the bottom left hand side of your screen and then in the query box you'll have to build a uh, procedure query. Now the way that we figured out how to do this is to put in orders where the signing provider is and then you'll type in your name here you'll add that and then in under order again the description is what you will want to choose here and then is again or contains actually is better um, because then it'll it'll include just that word if you like um, and let's say I want to figure out how many biopsies I've done so I'll, I'll include biopsy there I'll hit add here and then again similar to the patient numbers I won't want to hit search because that will tell me exactly who these patients are on the right hand side instead I'll hit count and it'll let me know exactly how many of these that I've ordered in the past now if I want to save this I'll go to save and then I'll type in um, the procedure that I've just queried uh, with my name and I can save it just for myself or for all users now um, to make this a little bit easier on our residents we've already saved many of these and if you want to just skip all of what I've done in the past here you can just go to select and you'll find a list of previous queries that someone has saved for global use so the easiest way to figure out how to do this on your own is to go to procedure um, in alphabetical order and then click OK and then it'll actually bring up an example of these queries that have been run in the past and instead of this provider you can change the name to yourself and then hit replace and then do a count and you'll see it's the same number as I typed in before so this is a pretty easy way to figure out how many procedures that you've done uh, for a specific procedure it almost certainly underestimates those procedures because this description has to be exactly the same it has to include this word biopsy if you've put in an order that for whatever reason um, is a similar order or marked similarly for this same procedure but doesn't include this word then um, you will not pick this up so this almost certainly underestimates the number of procedures that you've done um, but it's better than nothing